Deshaun Clue the second. And I'm Desha. So the weather was really muggy this morning. I'm anxious to hear what the rest of today will be like. What can you tell us, guys? Good morning, Central. I'm Hallie. And I'm Kylie. And here's the weather for today. The high today will be 80 degrees with a low of 63 degrees. The humidity today is 70%. Today will be mostly cloudy. That's it for weather today. Back to you, anchors. Thanks, guys. Yesterday, we congratulated our marching band on their recent performance of Bands of America in Canton. Here are Zach and Jesse with more information. Good morning, guys. I'm Zach. And I'm Jesse, here to talk about the marching band competition this past Saturday. The competition was a Bands of America regional competition, which is a really big deal. We performed this year's marching band show, Under This Starry Night, which is about a 10-minute show. Our show has four total parts, the intro, part one, part two, and part three. At the regional, we performed an improvised version of part three because we are still in the process of learning the rest of it. This is really early in the season for a regional, and this, is, this one just happened to be our first competition of the season. Bands are placed into classes which range from A to quadruple A. Our band is class triple A. Each class is based on size of the school from which the band originates. We finished in second place in our class. Our class consisted of three bands. The bands in our class were Hilliard Bradley, us, and Dublin Kaufman. At the end of the day, all the bands meet up at the field for a retreat. The retreat is where the overall placements are given. We finished fifth place, which is amazing for our first regional competition. Well, that's it from us. Back to you, anchors. Thanks, Zach and Jesse. And once again, congratulations, band. A few quick reminders. We will be on advisory schedule again this Friday for the homecoming pep rally. And don't forget to save your change for CE King High School. You can donate through your advisory. Now here's what is going on around here. Homecoming 2017 is just around the corner. The game is this Friday, September 22nd, and the dance is this Saturday at 7.30. The theme this year is Under the Stars. Homecoming tickets are on sale for just $10 and can be purchased at the activity window through Miss Baker. Tickets will not be sold at the door on dance night. If you must place a ticket, you must purchase a new one. You must have your ID to get a ticket and also have your ID to get into the dance on Saturday night. If you are bringing a non-CCHS guest, you must get a form filled out and approved by Officer Kurt. If you do not complete these forms by tomorrow, there is a chance your date will not be able to attend. And then, in honor of homecoming this week is Spirit Week. Here's a rundown of what, is, what to wear. Today, Senior Citizen Day. Ooh, tomorrow, Wacky Taurus Day. Thursday, Decades Day. Friday, Tie Dye Day. And here is a great news regarding that. If you need a tie dye shirt for Friday, Comic Crazy is, is here to help you out. During lunch periods on Thursday, Crazies will be tie dyeing shirts in the courtyard. You simply bring an old t shirt and we'll provide the dye. That is cool that Crazies is tie dyeing shirts. I know, right? Now let's head over to the locker room for sports. Good morning, Central. I'm Jalen. And I'm Nathan. And this is sports. First of all, information on the star passes. If you and your family are frequent attendees of any home game at CCHS that require an admission ticket, did you know you could purchase a family or star pass? Family passes and the star passes are available for purchase in the activities office. Please see the athletic office or activities window for details. Here's what's going on tonight. Traveling tonight is our boys' soccer team. They are heading to Marysville. Girls' volleyball is also traveling. They are heading to Westland. And then on our game tonight is girls' soccer. They take on Marysville at 7. A few final things. Strength and conditioning is Monday and Thursdays from 3.45 to 4.45 with Coach Reggie Cannon. The swim team conditions from 3.45 to 5 p.m. on Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. Meet in the hallway outside the wrestling room and be sure to wear appropriate clothing and water. Boys basketball has open gyms on Tuesdays and Thursdays from 6.30 to 7.30 in the Oz Gym. And lifting and conditioning is Mondays and Wednesdays after school from 3.30 to 5 p.m. Please see Coach Holman if you have any questions. Any student interested in playing spring softball for Central Crossing should attend open fields on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Please bring your gear and dress to play. Baseball open fields are Mondays and Wednesdays from 3.30 to 5.15. If you have any questions, see Coach Todd in room 5.45. Wrestling training is Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 4.15 p.m. And then open mats are Wednesdays, immediately following weight training conditioning. 
And finally, Gymnastic has open workouts every Thursday at Gotta Flip, 4.30 to 6. This is sports for today. Have a good one, Central. Back That's to you, good. Anchors. Thanks, guys. And now we have a few miscellaneous announcements. For you seniors, if you applied for youth at the booth, please check the wall outside the library to see if you were accepted. You also need a check to see which day you are to attend training, either Tuesday, October the 3rd, or Wednesday, October the 4th. In both cases, plan to arrive in the library by 8 a.m. Your books can be picked up before or after school in room 225. Please do not come during class. Seniors and juniors in the college search process are invited to visit day at Columbus State Community College. Visit days will be held on the Columbus campus Friday, October 20th and Friday, November 13th. Find out about Columbus State's excellent academic programs and transfer options to four-year universities. Visit cscc.edu to reserve your space today. Now we have club news. Today, Handmade by Me has their first meeting after school in the foods room. If you enjoy crafting and cooking, come check out this amazing club. This Wednesday, Key Club gets together. They meet after school in the foods room. Key Club is a community service organization that is a lot of fun. This Thursday, we have Guitar Club from Mr. Teich in room 180. And this Friday is GSA in room 264. And then, looking ahead, do you love to read? Do you wish reading was a competitive sport? Do you want to hang out with people who want to talk about books? Then you should join Battle of the Books! We will, be, we will have an informational meeting on Tuesday, September 26th at 7.30 a.m. in the library. If you cannot make the meeting, please see Mrs. Savage or Mrs. Bode. Everyone is welcome to come. That is it for today. Have a fantastic Tuesday. See you tomorrow, Central.